Humankind, read by Marion B. When Allah decided to create a human being, He collected every kind of soil and mixed it up, mixed it like a pottery potter's clay, molding it into the shape of a man. Allah breathed His spirit into it. In this way, he gave life to the first man, the father of all of us. Allah named him Adam. Allah gave him wisdom and made him the first prophet. Allah also created the first woman, Hawa or Eve, as a helper and loving companion of Adam. He told the couple to live in in the gardens of paradise, but warned them not to approach a, p- a particular tree. But sh- Satan d- deceived them to do against Allah's orders, but immediately they asked Allah's forgiveness for their wrongdoings. Allah forgave them both, but told them that since they have defied his orders, they would have to leave the gardens of paradise and go down to earth. There Adam and Hawa found themselves all alone, for no one else was living on the earth at that time. The story of the prophet Adam teaches us that we have all been created by Allah, and that therefore we are all equal. We should then respect each other and very hum- and every human being, and never look down on others or insult people. After all, we are all the children of the of one forefather, the Prophet Adam. Alayhi salam.